Hey Minecrafters, welcome back to the channel. Or to the channel if you're new here and to episode 44 in our All the Mods 9 series. So I've done a couple of things between episodes and we're also going to go back to Ad Astra today. So grab a drink, grab a snack, whatever it is that you get for while you watch videos. And let's get on with the fun. Okay, so when I went to start the video to do the the intro and all that stuff, um, <laughs> I don't know what was wrong, but I didn't have my skin on. It was just some random skin. And I was like, uh, okay. So I went and changed things and I was like, I, I log back in, my skin's fine, I'm here. But I don't know what the heck that was. Like I was just in my other world. So I know my skin was working, so I don't know what was going on with that. But if it happened to you guys, just log out. Reset your skin in the, the launcher and, and log back in. It should be okay. But, so I've been doing some things. The automation people are going to be happy. We'll talk about that in a minute. Got some comments to go over because this first one really, really made me laugh. So my granny, aka Bird Squirrel, they typed it this kind of like it was like a, they were playing it out for me. So it was meow. And they're like, wow, you could hear Robert from all the way over at the launch pad. Meow. That isn't a cat sound I've heard in Minecraft before. Meow. Pauses the video. Meow. Turns to find my neighbor's cat staring at me from the window. <laughs> That's so good. The kitty just wanted to join in and watch the video. You know, cats love me. <laughs> but thank you for leaving that comment, Bird Squirrel. That was uh, that made my day. I just I pictured it in my head because I know how neighborhood cats can be. So that was that was a nice little like palate cleanser for that day. So and I'm still enjoying the comment now. So thank you for that. Now Phantom914 says, I'm not sure if you were able to update the pack yet, but if you make a completely new instance and copy over only your world folder, it should work. I had the same exact issue because I started my save in October. You shouldn't have to do this every time, but just for things like this, when you start your game on beta versions of mod and then the mod devs change the code so what they're meaning is just like basically the backups that i have of my world folder completely delete my my all the mods from curseforge and then re-download it and then add the thing in because normally like i've been able to do updates just fine one by one but because i'm like i don't even know i'm several like 10 or so behind i would have to do it that way so i'm hoping that works because having to go one update at a time up 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 would take four freaking ever so i'm gonna try that we're gonna see if that works i don't know if they're trolling me i hope they're not <laughs> but i hope that works so thank you for the tip phantom i appreciate you shadow con says ad astra adds an enchantment for your helmet that lets you wear your better armor you will need at least one oxygen tank in your inventory though there is also a heat enchantment as well but you need stuff from venus for that one so i remember things um a couple of different things like that but yeah i thank you for reminding me about that because that's really good that i can use my my good gear but i mean I mean, the, the, things don't hit too hard there. Well, they might. I might be eating my words. But thank you for that, Shadow. I appreciate you as always. And uh, Senior Spam says, if interested, make it, it is it Teru Teru Bosu from Botania and feed it a sunflower and the rain will stop. All you need is eight mana string. Teru Teru is cute too. Oh, that's so adorable. Hold on. I'm going to look this up. Teru Teru Bosu Botania. hope I'm saying that right. Is a block added by the Batania mod. When placed in the world, it increases the amount of time that rain and storms last. Ooh. Okay, cool. I am definitely going to look that up. Thank you, Senior Spam. I appreciate that. And again, thank you to everyone who's left comments. As always, you guys are awesome. We have some stuff to do today. I am so excited. So, <clears throat> clear my throat for this one because Captain Automation is hopefully watches this, this episode because he's going to be a very happy and CC and Colin and all those people who are like, Creo, Automation, please, we beg of you. Listen. <clears throat> okay. So I did a thing and... It, 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 in my other world, I have refined storage. In this world, I have applied energistics, yeah? So in refined, uh, in my other world in ref with refined storage, I can't talk today, um, I learned how to do the automation because there's like the, um, like the crafters, like the, I think we have the, yeah, we've got the juicy crafters. We got like, extra storage crafters and stuff. So I learned how to use these and all that stuff. And I was like, I'm so proud of myself. I'm like, oh my God, this is so great. I'm going to go do that in the recording world. Wait. <laughs> I have applied energistics in my recording world. <laughs> and then I looked into auto crafting with applied energistics. And that's when I face planted into the floor. Because auto crafting with applied energistics, from what I've seen, because I've only been looking at videos and stuff, it is so much more complicated than refined storage. And I wanted to cry. So this is that's the stuff that I got up to between episodes. I didn't have time to fully learn the applied energistics auto crafting so i am calling on my captain and captain s automator and they automators to please t 
talk like just explain the automation process like not a big complicated automation system just like something comparable to just the easy peasy refined storage plop and automated like thing make the patterns and put it in and request the things to be crafted da, 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 da. something along that line just for until we move to the permanent area <clears throat> that I, when i can set up something bigger please i i this is my call to you automators out there please explain something easy er for applied energistics that's comparable to the auto crafting for refined storage with the with these with these doohickeys right here so please this is my request to you type it in the comments let me know because I, I was going to do it in this video and just spend the whole video figuring this stuff out. But then I remembered I wanted to continue at Astra. And we also have to do those two final glyphs for um, ours. <laughs> That's the mod. Uh, because I did do... Let's go back over to our, our, our friends over here. So what I did is I went and got one of the brutes from the Sunken Temple. This beautiful 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 purple guy right here and they drop um heart of the seas so i have them farming them and i have a bun bun for the feet so we can make the last two glyphs i made the easier ones i put them in here so i made these ones so those are all if you guys look over here at my quest if it'll open there we go my quest thing here so all of these are done we're just missing the ones with what is it called? Uh, Glyph of Luck and Lightning. <clears throat> Those are the last two, and then we will get the bong, which I need to prepare myself for because it is so loud. But yeah, we're gonna make those, then we're gonna continue with Ad Astra. Because I would like to get to Venus, I would like to get to some of the other planets, and we are going to go and visit those today. Because, yeah, Ad Astra is just a great mod, and I'm excited. And so please, automators, please, my, my, my friends, please explain to me and I don't want some big crazy system right now. I just want something, just to reiterate, comparable to the auto crafter from refined storage that you just put on the system and then you put in the, you make the patterns and, and so on and so forth. You plop it in, then you can, you know, control shift, request the amount, so on and so forth. If there's something comparable to that level with uh, applied energistics, please feel free to explain to me because you guys are lovely. And actually, I just noticed something. So. These guys here, these are the arcane cores, the same arcane core that you put under your enchanting infuser. Enchanting infuser? Enchanting apparatus, that's the word. These guys sell tokens. I have the Wixie token, Whirl of Spring token. There's a Whirl of Spring Drig Me token there. Whirl of Spring tokens, such siren shards. Um, yeah, so and they sell tablets as well. So if you guys are wanting to do a little bit of an easier way, just make a bunch of arcane cores, make some trading stations, grab some villagers. It's funny because the, the tables are so big, they kind of cover the villager. But uh, yeah, this is another way that you can do it. So um, you're welcome. <laughs> oh man, oh man, oh man. I've been up to some stuff. So let's see. I am going to clear my list because I need to do that. Uh, clear that. Oopsie doopsie. Oopsie doopsie. There we go. Uh, I did this. Oh, and another thing. I wanted to check if Robert is in this. Oh, he is! Oh, look at the little baby! Okay, so if we have time, I would like to get into mechanism a little bit. This might have to be a next episode thing, because we'd have to start diving straight into mechanism. Um... But I love Mechanism. It's one of my favorite tech mods in existence. Uh, so that might be a next time thing. If no time to do Robert in this episode, do Mechanism next time. Because if you guys don't know, Robert is the cutest little robot. And you can actually change his colors. And you can name him. So he's going to be named Timo, of course. And yeah, he's just the cutest, sweetest little thing. I don't think we have one yet. I don't think we do. Uh, no, I don't think we do. No, unfortunately, we haven't gotten any from like a loot bag or whatever, but that's fine. Let's make these glyphs and get this done. Um, let's see if our little dudes now, these guys have been busy. I've already emptied these when I was on here earlier and yesterday tinkering around. I've emptied these chests probably four times. Like 
the amount of stuff these guys produce is wild. Now, something I was confused about in my other world, I set this exact thing up, but I didn't have the treasure goblins. I just had like the apothe apotheosis bosses and other stuff. And they don't produce any of these things. Do, are these only from the treasure goblins or do the treasure goblins have to be in the area for them to produce these from the apotheosis bosses? Because I have like five or six apotheosis bosses and the entities around and they're only grabbing the loot like the normal like shulker boxes and the totems of undying. They're not grabbing all of these goodies that these guys are. So but the only and the only difference between the two is the treasure goblins. So do the treasure goblins have to be there is my question. Because I cannot figure out for the life of me why. I, everything's the same. They're in an archwood forest. They have enough space. They have all the stuff they need but they're not producing the same thing. So if anybody knows why that is, please let me know. Anywho, <laughs> more babble. So let's take a look. There should be in here. Hi. Oh, oh, look at him. He, oh, he's so cute. Let's see. Oh, heart of the sea. Ba-bam. Okay. And then rabbit's feet. Ba-bam. Perfect. Okay. This is so much easier. So we're just going to stick those in there. Now, what else do we need for those glyphs? What was the last one? Lightning. Oh, if I could type, sweet Jeebus. Okay. What am I missing? Am I missing lightning rods? I thought so. Okay, let's make three lightning rods. One, two, three. Boop. There we go. That's one. Oh god, the bong is going to be so loud. I'm actually kind of not looking forward to this. Okay, that's one. I'm I'm really irritated that those didn't trigger when we made them before. Okay, what's the last one? Uh, and luck, right? Oh god, please. I mean, I could go into the FTB. You know what? Actually, you know what I think I might do? Because that startles me every single time. I'm going to go into edit mode. Um Oh, no. I forget where it is. Maybe I won't. I forget there's a thing that where you can turn off the bong. But I forget where it is and I don't want to go clicking random buttons and potentially screwing up my quest book. So, yeah, we're just going to deal with it. Cliff of Luck, select. Okay, are you guys ready for the bong? I turned down my audio. <laughs> I don't know if that turns down the audio for you guys in the, in the recording, but I turned down. I, I was a big baby and I have a scroll bar on my keyboard for my audio and i just instantly turned that down because that was loud okay we are finally done the r's quest line yay round of applause let's go woo, woo, woo. <laughs> i'll just do this for this one. Oh my gosh we're done we're done the r's quest line folks we're done I mean, we're still going to tinker around with it because it's fun. And these guys produce a crap ton of stuff, but we're done. We're done the Ars quest line. That is it. That is, she is done so. Now, um, the thing f for the oxygen, I, th I think we'll just wear the other stuff first, just while we go to the next place. Um, let me look at our Ad Astra thing here. Wait. Um... The hammer is used to make place from Angus, so there's a compressor to this. Oh, I guess I just have to make the hammer and the compressor? Why did that not trigger? So this. And then the compressor, right? Did I not make a compressor? Oops, I made two by accident. Oopsie doopsie. There we go. I'm just gonna click. Oh my god, can I click the button, please? I guess it's not letting me click the thing. Okay. Oh my god, this is annoying. <laughs> a beacon! Let's go! That's a good reward. There we go. So that is all done. So, now we need to go and cook up our ostrum. Oh crap, I just put gems in there like a dingus. Not what I meant to do. Oh crap. Uh, I think those are the only two, right? There we go. Let's put these away here. Put this here. Okay. 
Look at your puppy. Oh, we still haven't named the puppy. So name the puppy, you guys. You can choose a name. Um, now, what was I doing? Oh yeah, at Astra. Oh my gosh, I'm so distracted by all the things happening. Like there's dancing cutie pies over here. There's a puppy. There's a, where did that come from? Um, oh, what's all this stuff over here? What are you guys collecting dirt and stuff over here for? Okay. Um, yeah. All right, let's head home. Let's go get that. Oh, my good gravy. Let's get that ostrom cooked up. Wait. Oh, because I can't type. Oh, my good golly gosh. That's an ostrom ingot. Can I double this? I don't think I can, no. All right, so our ostrom is good. Oh, it's such a pretty color. Fluid pipes. Ooh, glowing ostrom pillar. Oh, the ostrom sliding door is so nice. Uh, okay, this. Ooh, we, oh, the first, the first wind turbine. The first one we've gotten. We don't need it anymore, but we've got one. Much happy. Look at that. Okay, so now what we need to do is we need to make the um, the netherite spacesuit. Uh, yes, yes, we we. What is the oxygen? The ad astra. What is it called? It's the something or other. Is it an enchantment? I think it's an enchantment, right? Mm-hmm. It's called space breathing. Can breathe in an astro dimensions, use energy or durability, requires oxygen can in inventory. There's acid rain in that astra. Space fireproof. Space breathing. Oh, you can make it with moonstone. Okay, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Hold down. Um space stone. We should have space stone, right? Wait, 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 wait. Moonstone. Moon cobblestone. Did we not get moon cobbles? Yeah, oh my god. Creo, use your brain. I'm assuming I only need it on one item? Okay, we've got space breathing. Let's do gravity normalizing. Mars stone, space boots. Mars cobblestone. Boom. Okay. So, what pieces of gear do these go on? I'm guessing the helmet would be the breathing one. So now, use energy or durability. Require oxygen can in inventory. Um, so oxygen can? This is oxygen can. Oh, wait. Oh. It goes in the curio slot. Netherite oxygen can. Hold on. Okay. Does it have to be in your curio slot though? Because is there...
Yeah, because I only have one curio slot and it's for my thing. Can I just keep... Oops. Can I just keep it in my inventory? Now do the space boots. Use energy or durability. Energy. Energy or durability. But if I don't... Wait. Oh god, I hope I'm not going to die. That's fuel. Okay. Should I make another one of those cans just to be safe? I kind of think I should. Maybe I'll make a few. There we go. Just to, just to over-prepare. Now, I'm confused about the energy or durability thing, though, because we have... Um, because we have uh, unbreakable stuff, right? When they say energy, do they mean, like, food energy? Like, I don't, I don't know what that means. Well, I guess we're going to find out. Okay, so we need fuel. Okay. Oh, and we need to make a better rocket. Oh, that's right. Oh, crap. Okay. We need to make the tier three rocket now. Okay. Oh, my favorite one. She's so pretty. Okay. And then we need to make four of these. Good, good. And then we need to make the nose boop, like so. Like that. And then we need to make two of these. And then we need to make this. Oh, we need more iron rods. This and this and this there we go this 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 there she be oh yeah look at her Ooh. even bigger <laughs> oh she's beautiful So let's get. Oh, 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 nope, nope, nope. I'm a little nervous that I maybe misunderstood something, and I'm kind of hoping I didn't. Okay, so let's head over there. Oh, we need glowstone. Oops. My gosh, my eye is so itchy right now. Why is it itchy? Like this. Grab a bunch of glowstone. Ba bam, ba bam. I could cast the the light glyph or the light thing on myself but does that does it last longer if it's a higher tier let, let, let's take a look here hold on let's go c and then go and then we'll do okay so self conjure mage lights that's uh, extends the time that spells last including buffs fangs and summons Okay. Self light creates. Can I make it rainbow? Whoa! Now see how long it lasts for. 34 seconds. Wait, but isn't there like Wow, that's bright. Isn't there um Isn't there one that makes it last, like... Because I have the tier 3 ones, don't I? Mm, I really don't like how short that lasts. Is there one to make it last longer? I don't think so. 
Firework, Dispel, Evaporate, Explosion, Discharge. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, maybe not. That's just, no. That's not going to work for me. Oh, I need to put this away, though, before I accidentally... Look at 17 hours in our time in a bottle. Put that there. We have everything else. We've got our food. We've got our fuel. we got our oxygen cans. Okay, let's head over there. And if we start suffocating, well, rip. Wait. Is the next planet a hot planet? Mm. I don't remember. I should have looked at the book. Because I know Venus is a hot one. I should have looked. I'm going to have to double check before we go. Mm. Hold on. Mercury ad Astra. Um, I should have looked at the book and I don't want to go back down. just to Oh no. Okay, so Mercury is water and ice. Okay, so we need to go to Mercury first. Okay. Wait, it said Mercury was water and ice. Uh-oh. But that doesn't look like water and ice. Rut row. We're going to get our tool ready to boop. So far, so good. Wait, why is my space outfit with me? Did it break when we took off? Maybe. Okay. So, so far so good, right? Now, are there any buildings? What? Oh, because I was typing it wrong. Let's see here. Meteor, Mars Temple. <clears throat> okay, so I don't think there's anything on Mercury. But I'm assuming there's ore we need for Mercury, right? Let's look in the book. Um. Oh, so Mercury is hot. Your new goal is to gather enough calorite to build the ultimate rocket. Oh, so I guess we're fine on the hot planets then. Because we have this gear. Oh, okay. Well, let's go get some calorite then. Oh gosh, it is dark. Mercury stone is... Oh, wait. Um, Mercury cobblestone... Put that there, put that there, there we go. That stone is so pretty. I guess I should use my silky for that. Actually, no. So calorite, Shh. is this calorite spoil this one? Or is calorite on Venus? 
Because I know Venus is going to have some goodies for us to explore. But if I'm okay on Mercury, I should be okay on Venus, right? Okay, so the netherite oxygen can is getting used. Okay, good. Are you going to feed me? Thank you. Is Calorite... Hold on. Let's see. Oh, without a netherite spacesuit or fire resistance, you will die very fast. The so next ma material you seek is calorite. Calorite is used. Okay. So I'm assuming it's here. Thank you for pointing out the uh, the enchantments, by the way, because I didn't want to have to go and make a whole new spacesuit. I guess I don't need the heat one because I guess my gear counts towards that. Is Calorite in this dimension? I remember before that there was like a... Like I couldn't find it on one of the planets. So maybe it is on Venus? Hmm. I'm sitting differently today, so hopefully not uh, leaning too far into the mic. Yeah, because I haven't found anything. No calorite's not the most common, but there's iron. Let me look it up here. Deep slate calorite ore. Oh yeah, it is Venus. Because you guys see this Venus calorite ore here? So we do have to go to Venus for it. Okay. Well let's go back up to the surface and check out this uh this planet. Can I get out, please? Just gonna adjust how I'm sitting. Hopefully it doesn't change the audio too much. Let's head back up. Yeah, I'm, is there anything on Mercury? I mean, other than a bunch of dudes and slimes and stuff. I mean, I guess we could just go straight to Venus from here, right? Let's do a little fly around. And see if we can see anything. Or anyone, or whatever. Hello? I don't remember a lot about this planet. Hello? Oh, he bouncing. He going <laughs> super boing. Very bright. Very, very bright. That is for dang sure. Okay. Like, I think I've always wondered why some planets have some stuff and, you know, like, what's what's the point of Mercury? Am I missing something? Like, it doesn't say. <clears throat> oh, yeah, so Glacio is still the last one. <clears throat> With more protection, additional oxygen storage of flight is expensive to craft, but it offers high-speed flight, making travel easy. It's got two modes of flight. I, I don't think we really need to make this because we have a jetpack. Okay, so yeah, we can just keep our, our normal gear. So is this really it for Mercury? Is there nothing else? Hello? Uh, except for floating slimes. Hello, little dudes. Where's all the music?
Hello? Do we just need to go straight to Venus? Do I have my luck charm on me? I do, but why is it? Is this still running? No, okay. I'll put that on me. Hmm. Interesting. Mercury globe. Huh. Well, we might just head over to Venus, I guess. I am such a dummy. Do you guys see what I did? I forgot to make a launch pad. Oh, I'm so glad we have our wireless remote. <laughs> Whoopsie. All right, well, let's head to Venus because this is boring. All right. There's my rocket. And we need one, two, three. Oh, no. One, two, three. Nope, that's four. There we go. Bunk. 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 Bunk, bunk, bunk. All right. Off to Venus we go. Let's go. Bye, Mercury. You're kind of boring. Pretty stone though. I'm going to land right. Yes. Ouch. Oh, I'm getting burned by the rain. Wait, wait. Do I need to? Okay, hold on. I think we need the acid rain thingy. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna go look at the acid rain. Is that acid rain or is that... That's the acid rain, right? Right? Oh, I need to get Venus stone for that crap. Because I hate that sizzling sound. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, and we need calorite. Ooh, we might have to go back and just start digging. Okay, we're out of the rain. <laughs> okay, we need to start digging for calorite because I want to, um, I want to make that, oh crap. I want to make that, uh, that acid rain thing. Give me some cal- oh, there she be! There she be. How much do we have? 
Okay, we've got plenty. We're just gonna quickly go back. I mean, technically I could just cook this here. We don't really need to go back. Let's just make a, a furnace. Actually, do we have a blast furnace? Do we have any furnaces? Okay, we got an iron furnace right here. There we go. Stick you in here and then get some coal. Then we'll cook you up. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Okay, and then we need to make the... <clears throat> oh crap, I didn't save it. Add an Astra. And then it's... This one, I think, right? Need to cook up some Venus... Nope, nope, nope. Venus stone. We also need to make a calorie plate. Oh, I already have books. What am I doing? Take this out for now, cook that, good, good. How many do I need for that? Seven, okay. This, sh this is acid rain, right? Or is this the fire, space fire? Oh, did I grab any mercury stone? Okay, good, I did. Okay, good. Let's just do all of them. What does that go on though? I know, I know. There we go. <laughs> to quickly take the gear off so I don't die. Acid rain proof? Okay. Does that go on the helmet? Nope. Does that go on the pants? Nope. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, we need XP levels. Oh crap. Well, we're gonna have to chug a bunch of expetrified ore because I don't want to go back. Actually, we might have to. That's going to take for freaking ever. Hold on. Let's just head back real quick. Grab all this stuff. Really is a gamble. Um, grab you. This chest, right? There we go. Put you back. Grab some from there. Okay, let's go back. So now we should be okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi, Stinky. You should be okay, right? Up, 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 up. Yeah. All gone. Okay, let's go get some more calorite and then we'll go exploring. This stone is so pretty. All those, all those levels have come into to good use, that's for sure. Can I get back down, please? Oh, I gotta keep an eye on my oxygen. All right, calorite, gimme. Is there a calorite site? I don't think there is, is there? No. Oh, I hear a little grumblies. Hey, what are you? Goodbye. I just need some more calorite, please. Oh, 
Oh, I see some. And then we're gonna go and explore because I know that there are structures on this this planet, unless it's been changed. But some of the structures are so cool. Oh, feed me, please. Thank you. Oh, the Venus gold ore. That looks really cool. So, does my fortune not work here? Like, I have fortune 20 million. Like, hello? And I know people are asking me if I'm ever going to do the Library of Alexandria. Don't worry. We're going to be doing everything we possibly need to do to finish everything. We got so much stuff to do still. <clears throat> lots and lots of stuff. Oh, and diamonds. So diamond, coal, gold, calorites. Ooh, Venus is uh, quite lucrative. I wonder if like the chunk destroyers and stuff would work here. I mean, I don't know why you would need to. Ooh, hello, what are you? Sulfur creeper. Oh, you're so you're kind of cute. Look at you. Adorable. Okay, so we're on negative 39, and that seems to be a good level for Calorite. Seems to be. Oh my gosh, you know, my stomach. It's like I'm fine until I start recording, and then for whatever reason, she's just like, hi. I know, I know I've been silent at the whole start of your day, but uh, how about you give me a little nummy nummies, hmm? hmm? I know you're trying to get recording done, but you know, you know, I'm, I'm here too. For anyone that's been in my stream, you know, I tend to just ignore eating and then you guys yell at me and then I have to eat, so. I promise I will have a snack soon. I've only been recording for like just under an hour. I will get to snack soon. Don't worry. And when I'm in focus, focus mode, I want to get all the stuff done and do the things and have the, you know, the stuff going on. Oh, I have also traveled too far down. Hello, little sulfur creeper. Boop. Oh man, I'm so glad they reminded me about those enchants because it's so much better having my gear. Okay, so we should, oopsie. We should have plenty of calorites. But I kind of just want to collect a little more, you know? Just gotta, that, that, that mentality of like, just, just a little more, just a little more. Just a little more is perfect. I remember coming here with a uh, experience boost in FTP Skies. Uh, experience not not xp boost the not the like the one that says xp like xp but the experience boost enchant um where it's typed out experience boost that enchant is so unbelievably op especially when you can stack it oh my gosh i was getting xp coming out the wazoo it was crazy kind of glad it's not in this pack though because it is insanely op and there's so many ways to get xp like your chunk destroyer your furnaces like there's no need for all that Alright, I think we have plenty, as she keeps going. I want to go to the surface, and I want to go and check out some of the structures. This is where the pygros are, which is what I didn't want to say the name of them in the last episode. This does not spoil it a little too much. Am I saying it right? Pigro? Pygro? Because it's P-Y, right? So it looks like it would be pygro, but they're pigs, so maybe pygro? I don't know. Maybe that's how you say it. Somebody correct me if I'm wrong. Okay. We have another thing in here, right? Yeah. I'm just gonna keep those on my hotbar to keep track of the um, stuff. Okay. So let's go and look for some structures. Um, I guess I could use the structure compass.
Oh, this is here. If you would rather use your own armor rather than having to wear the spacesuit all the time, you can enchant your helmet using the space breathing enchant. For this to work, you'll need an oxygen can in your inventory. The oxygen can only works for colder planets, but can be upgraded. Okay, so I'm glad I did the netherite one then. Because, uh, yeah. Apparently, I needed to do that. Okay, so. So it's Pygro Tower or Pygro Village? 1,784 this way. I'm going to grab a snack and then we'll travel over there. All right, so got a snack and now we're traveling over there. We're about 300 blocks away. Kind of letting the world do its thing and load in a little bit here. Definitely going to keep my eye on these oxygen tanks, though. I'm glad I made more than one because good grief. That actually goes quite fast. Wait, what? It said I passed it. Wait, am I blind? I just like spaced out, <laughs> spaced out. But like, wait, what? <laughs> Did I? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, it's right here. Oh, these are so cool looking. Oh, there's two. There's the tower <clears throat> and the little village thing. So this here, God, that looks so cool. Hey dudes, look at them, they're little puppies. Okay, so maybe they're not pigs, so they are pygros. Oh, they're so cute. Look at them with their little tongue sticking out. Oh, oh wow, this is beautiful. Wow, so purple stained glass in front of um, those lights. Wow, actually, that looks... That's a really cool little effect. It's like a purpley green. Okay. I'm gonna take that. Thank you. Oh, and black stained glass. Interesting. Okay. Uh oh, they didn't like that. Bye. Bye. I'm gonna take all these because I'm that person. I just won all the pretty blocks. Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh, they angry. Bye. Oh, I forgot to turn my luck charm on. There we go. I don't know if that's actually going to work here or not, because he's this loot seems kind of oof, you know? Hi. There you go. Bye-bye. Now that anger level is going to carry over to the other tower, so I should probably try to take care of them. adds the blood splatters my my uh jetpack fart bubbles are in my way are we good i hear a little stinky right there okay so that's done i kind of want to collect the rest of these though I will take all this. I really love that purple and green together. That's really pretty. Okay. Now, this. This is where some stinkies are. Hi. I see you. Hey, Snorty. Oh, they gonna be angry at me now. Bunk. Bunk. Oh my god, I do this every time I'm here. Stop! Uh, I can't click my bow because my reach is so far! <laughs> the downside to reach being this... I, I can't... Get this guy? There we go. Oh, hello? Oh. Oh, they big inky. You guys know I'm right here, right? Hello? 
Hello? Oh. Hello? We'll loot in just a minute. I want to get rid of all the stinkies. These guys are so cute. Like, I wish you could tame them, but they're very much not friendly. Oh, he moved. Uh, am I? Wait, what? Yeah, I'm really just that bad with a bow, apparently. Right rope. Right rope. Right rope. Right rope. Right rope. Right rope. Is there another stinky in there? Just shooting the little tootsies. Wait, I hear... Oh. The little one sounds so derpy. I love it. Okay, there should be more. Where are you guys? Should be way more of you. Yeah. Hello? Look at all that ancient debris. Very tasty. Oh, stupid gate. Very, very tasty. I mean, <clears throat> depending on how far you are in your pack by now, you should have plenty from your chunk destroyer, but... Yeah, so that's that. Let's go inside. We got this. I'll take that. And I'll take that. And I'll take that. And I'll take that. Oh, hello, little dude. Can I? There we go. Oh, I was trying to not destroy the building, but okay. Um... Oh, I see one down there. Let's go in the big building here. Is there anything in these barrels? No. Oh, there's a chest there though. Oh, so the loot's like, meh, you know, it's not the best. Not the greatest, not the worst. I mean, my luck is, let's see. Yeah, 2588. Let's go down. I really love the look. Oh, they have respawn anchors and stuff here. Nice. I really love the look of obsidian and crying obsidian. Can I get down the stair? Oh my god, my jetpack is like, no. Hello? Hi. Just hiding over there. Is there any loot down here? I don't think so. Oh, for Pete's sake, this freaking reach. Oh my god. I have to like aim away to. <laughs> I hit the bell. I need to make sure that I, I try to reset my spawn point when I go home because I've clicked so many beds not thinking. So I don't think it did anything because it was too far away, but... Oh, there's a baby one! Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, Snorty. These don't have anything, but that does. Ding! 
Can I get out, please? Oh my god. I'm stuck. Oh, I think this is the one I accidentally clicked. Yep. Can I get out? All right. I think that is it for this location. This, this lovely... Oh, actually, we didn't go in here. Wait. Right, right, right. Oh my god, the, the speed. Good grief. Yeah, this is pretty much diamonds and nether loot and stuff like that, which makes sense. Now, I don't know if these are... Hello? I don't know if these are the... Um... Pygro Village? Yeah, so this is a Pygro Village and a Pygro Tower. So I think that's it for this dimension, or this moon, or planet, whatever. Venus Bullet. Wait, what? What's this? 613 blocks this way. What's a Venus Bullet? Let's go take a look. Because I really want to get to Glacio today. I really, really want to go see Glacio. Venus bullet. Wait, what? Is it below ground? We're going to have to head home first. I'm just going to use the waystone um, because I need to get some more fuel and some more oxygen. We might actually have time to start on mechanism today. We're just going to see how far we get. What is it? Uh, whatever. Okay, home. There we go. Turn you off you there put you there put you there oh so they fill up wait oh no they don't i'm dumb um okay so where's the empty one there's one there oopsie oopsie i turned the wrong thing on there we go there we go and then over here we're gonna put you in here and just fill you guys up again I feel like those go by pretty quickly, but I don't know how long we'll be on Glacio because I don't remember there really ever being anything super crazy there except for like stinking cuteness. So um, we are going to have to make some cages. There is one thing I'm confused about, and it's this. It's like Glacio lot like there's like a tree or something in I don't know whatever we'll, we'll we'll take a look at it when we get there. But I need to make some cages. I need to put the calorite into the furnace so we can make the next rocket. So let's go do that. A ba bam. A ba bam. And we'll turn in our quests. Oh, I thought I already turned that in. Oh, we got a sink. Cool, thank you. What is this? Once we explore the moon and gather space for the uh, people to create space stations. Oh yeah, we didn't do the space stations, right. Okay, if we actually, instead of mechanism, if we have time, we'll make a space station. If didn't make space station in episode, do it next time. Space the space stations are really cool. Very, very cool. Kind of small, but they're cool. Okay. So, let's do this and then go calorite block. There we go. And then we need four of these again. Same drill. Do this. Little nose tip booper. There we go. And then do this. We need some of these. Go. One, two. 
and then oh i need oh 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 i need some more uh oh are these oh oh i'm clicking all the wrong buttons there we go and then there we go and then this oh no this boop 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 all right let's go make our calorite rocket grab you oh i think i need to put more oil into the um into the thing Boop. oh there she be where's my sleeping bag too dark Oh yeah, look at that behemoth. Big. Okay, let's fill this up. There we go. We got more fuel. We're gonna fuel up our beeb here. There we go. Just gonna put all the stuff in here for now. We got plenty of oxygen. All right, so Glacio, if you guys don't know, you don't need um, your spacesuit there. I mean, obviously, if you have this, it's fine, whatever, with your enchants and all that jazz, but uh, you can breathe there. Unless it's been changed. So let's read the book just so I'm not putting my foot in my mouth. Let me just duble check. Um, there is supposed to be an entry about it, is there not? Oh, should we make a rover just for the sake of Glacio and just kind of see? Okay, let's see. Let's see. See if we can make rover. Because it is absolutely adorable. Little wonky to drive. But it is quite entertaining. I need some dash blocks. What else do I need? Steel block and this. It's a little wonky to drive. I she um, <laughs> the sound. Did you guys hear that sound? Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna shut up when I put it down. <laughs> I swear that wasn't my stomach. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. Oh, that's so funny. That is so funny. Okay, so we've got extra fuel for Rover. Oops. We're gonna, oh, for Pete's sake. We're gonna bring, I don't think there's any enemies there. There might be, I don't remember. But actually, I don't think we need the oxygen can either. Um, but let's get Rover. Let's get some fuel cans. Oh, oh, I already fueled up the rocket, didn't I? Okay, let's head over to Glacio. Look at us. Oh, we're at the big boy rocket. Oh, look at us go. Such a cool mod. I'm actually really excited for the Stargate stuff. I also just realized that the launch pad and the rockets are not covered by the claim protection. Whoops. Okay. Proxima Centauri, Glacio. Oxygen true. There, it says it right there. I think I'll put our space station. Why can't I say space station? I will put our space station over Glacio. Now, I saw something about like a Glacio tree or like some sort of. Is that something I have to like you do in the alchemist table? But you guys, for the, those of you that haven't been to Glacio, you're going to see why I love this planet. Probably quite quickly, other than the purple stone. They're probably going to be around here somewhere. There they are. <gasps> there they are. Oh, oh, look at them. Oh, <laughs> you guys are so stinking cute. Oh, I love you. I've already done a thumbnail with you guys, though. I don't want to do another one, but oh my God, you're so cute. 
Yoink. Yoink. What for? Yoink. Little baboos. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Let's put Rover down. I don't know if Rover's gonna be... Is it gonna be good for this? I don't know. I do know I have to drive in third person, though. Oh, it is. It's so quiet. Literally the quietest car in existence. Uh-oh. 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 Um, problem. Oh, Rover, no! Rover, no! Okay, well, uh, there's, um, powdered snow, but let's, let's grab some powdered snow while we're here, no? Yeah, yes, no, maybe so? Give me more buckets. We're gonna need it for something, I'm sure. There we go. Alright, so, uh, yeah. We're gonna block this from this and then put it in this, oh, oh, in this, because I want this glacier stone. Now, there is... Okay, so f first things first, we can put this away. Second thing, um, I thought there was some sort of a, like a log, like a glacial log, right? Yeah, glacian log. Ah, so it is the alchemy table. Do I have that with me? Or not with me, but in my storage. I do. Okay, we're gonna try this. Cause that ta or that table, that wood is so pretty. But there's no sapling, so how do you get the leaves? Oh, the bees. From a lumber bee. Hmm. I wonder if they're ever going to put productive trees in this. Now, again, I'm like 10 updates behind, but productive trees is such a beautiful mod. Okay, so let's try this. Let's get a log. Does it have to be any log? I don't know. I'll put this here. Ah. Okay, yeah. Look at that. It's so pretty. <gasps> Oh, I love it. I love it so much. Okay, so now we're going to collect. I don't. I don't think. Oh, and torches will work here, too, because there's oxygen. I don't think that's. Um, there's any specific ores on Glacio. Like, it's just like normal overworld ores just in Glacio stone. But I want to grab a bunch of this because this is very pretty. And we should have a little bit of time to look into mechanism. Because I, I really want Robit. And, well, technically it'll be Teemo, but... That little robot is so freaking cute. I do have to mute the sound for the charge pad, though. Um, and I'd go... We'll go back up to the surface. There's really not much here. Um, just snow and ice. But it is a very good planet to all of these planets are great for resources like the snow and the ice and you know all these stone and all these stone all the stone and things like that but uh, other than that i mean it's pretty much just good for like exploration and all that jazz but we've pretty much seen everything it's not a huge mod um and it's definitely something like it's one of those things that i wanted to do when i had enough resources because it's just easy to just pop resources in and wham bam bam you know but uh, yeah, okay, we've got plenty of the stone now. Let's go back to the surface. Uh, actually, I think I might grab some more of the permafrost. Wait, does that work without silk touch? It does, okay. Grab some more of the permafrost. Okay. So let's travel around a wee bit and we'll take a look at everything and then we'll go back and then we'll start looking into mechanism. I'll grab a bunch of ice while we're here as well. Might as well. I'm sure we'll need it for something. That's my, my mentality in, in modded Minecraft, or in M Minecraft in general, but just since I pretty much just strictly play modded, it's my mentality is just, I'm gonna need it for something. I'm absolutely gonna need it for something. 
But yeah, this is pretty much it. This is this is Glacio. It's just a uh, snowy barrens and snowy landscape and I mean all these planets are good if you want to, you know, build things here or, you know, put machines here or come and spend time with the cute little rams cuz they're just the absolute stinking cutest. Oh my god, look at them. Look at the cute little babies. A little pinky purple color on them. Oh my god, they are the cutest things ever. Oh. Oh, and somebody mentioned if, because uh, I had asked in the last episode, what happens if you bring the Lunarians to the overworld? They turn into normal villagers, apparently. That's boring. I was kind of hoping they'd hold their their shape, so to speak. Oh, they're the cutest. You guys are just out here, just just you. It's, it, this should be called the, the Ram Planet, because it's just, it's yours. It's all yours. What do you guys eat? What do they eat? Wait, what food do they eat? Wait. Do you guys eat wheat? Can I give you food? Hold on. Can I can I feed you food? Do you like food? Can I give you food? No. Do you guys eat what do rams eat? Potatoes? <laughs> I don't know. No? What do they eat? Uh, I wanna give what about carrots? I wanna give oh, that's not how you spell carrot. Um They don't eat any food. Oh my god. I put chapstick on and ugh, made a mess. Okay. Oh, well, I don't know what to feed you, you little dudes. You're so cute though, but I am going to put a waystone here. Ram planet. We're going to go home and we're going to start looking into mechanism for the rest of the episode. Um, Let's take a look. I'm just going to empty this stuff out. I'll bring you guys back. And then we will um, continue on and see. Oh my god, if I could type and see what the dealio is. Okay, so I was looking in this and I was like, wait, we, ne we need to finish this quest book. And then I realized we didn't make the cryo freezer. We need to make steel ingots, dash plates, and dash ingots okay so let's do this we have steel ingots okay dash plates dash ingots okay oxygen distributor oh my god So I'm guessing this is like if you want to live on the the planets or, you know, set up a base there or something like that. This is what you would probably do. Am I a derp? What did I just... What? Okay, there's the oxygen distributor. Now the cryo thing, so the cryo freezer makes fuel that's better than the normal fuel. It makes it with those uh, those crystal shards. So it's definitely something, uh, if you guys are gonna be traveling around a lot, it's definitely something you're gonna wanna make. So that's done. Um, What else? I visited Mercury. Oh, wait. Oh, but I have the. Oh, wait. Did I not make the netherite spacesuit? Am I? <laughs> uh. I swore I made this. Oh, no, I didn't because I'm an absolute derpsicle. Okay, hold on. Let's grab another right helmet from here. Um, <clears throat> probably gonna need more of those. Okay, so helmet, bam. Chest plate. Uh, another right chest plate, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Netherite space pants. 
I'm guessing we're going to need netherite booties. There we go. Netherite space pants. Bam. Netherite space boots. Bam. That. That. Bam, bam. Got all these. Oh, that's where we get the Mars uh, thing, or the Mercury globe from. Okay. So now... We need to make the jet suit. Okay, so maybe we won't start me mechanisms today. Maybe we'll do that next time because we're trying to finish this, but we'll see. And I have to remember the bong is going to happen. Okay, so jet suit helmet. Okay, so we need our netherite space suit. <clears throat> boop, boop. Um... Another eight space boots, another eight space pants. Oh, we got night vision goggles. Don't I already have those on? I don't. Do I have a space for them though? I do. i turn that off. So you guys can toggle the night vision with a, a, a key bind as well, if you don't know that. Okay, so jet suit. Oh boy, okay. Get some more of these. Oops, oops, oops. Of these, this, this, this. Oh my god, it's like building a rocket in a suit. Oh, I need another hammer. There we go. Pants. Uh oh, the bong's gonna happen and it's gonna make me panic. So loud. Okay, ready? Wait. Hello? Bong? Ah, Jesus! I was waiting for that! <laughs> There's the bong! Okay, let's let's see let's see what it looks like. Ooh, fancy! Oh wait. Oh. Oh, I guess you need oxygen. Okay, that makes sense. Cool. We did the thing. Oh, crap. I really need to remind myself to move that scroll. I think I can in the config file anyways. All right, that's done. Okay, so let's let's check our globes out. How many of the globes do we have? How many of the globes are there? Oh, no, we don't. Wait, we only have two. Wait, how do I get the other ones? Can I spin them? Oh, I can. Oh, that one's so pretty. How do I get the... the globes? No! Wait, do I have to put it in, like, the alchemy table? That would be hilarious. Hold on. Is the alchemy table... Wait, 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 wait. Globe. No. How do I get the other globes? I want them! God, the moon is so pretty. That is, oh, I love that. That is so nice. Can you just turn angled? Can I, whatever. Anyways, okay. So let's look into Robit real quick. Oops. Okay, that's another one done. Oh my gosh. So we've done Ars Nouveau, Ad Astra, Twilight Forest. We need to do Blue Skies. Oh, right, we haven't finished Blue Skies. What didn't we finish? Mmm. Have I not gotten this sword yet, though? No. Okay, so we're going to have to finish the Blue Skies quest line next time, too, because that'll be easy enough. That should be easy enough. Okay, so let's look into Robit real quick. So Robit, this cute little stinker right here. So we need energy tablets, atomic alloys. Oh yeah, we are definitely going to need to make, yeah, we need the metallurgic infuser. Um, I need to make the basic control circuit. Okay, so actually, hold on. Metallurgic infuser. Okay, we're just gonna do two of those. Just gonna plunk them here for now. Oh, wait, no. 
Oh crap, my bag's on. Oh, actually I need to space it out one more. There. Okay. We also need to put stuff underneath it too, but for the sake of just making rabbits, we also need the charging pad though. And I don't think I have one. I don't, okay. Um, it needs to be the mechanism charge pad. There we go. So the energy tablets, yeah, I need to make infused alloy. So infused alloy is redstone and iron. We actually might be able to do this. Redstone. I don't have any of the speed upgrades, I think, which is fine. We do need points though. I'm just gonna do, I'm not gonna bother cabling them because we're gonna move them anyways. That should be machines, right? That should give you guys power, right? Yep. So they go pretty slowly, um, normally, but that's fine. Cause I don't think I have the stuff to make the speed upgrades right now. Uh, the speed and the efficiency upgrades, which we're, we'll get into when we dive deeper into mechanism. Oh, but the sound of those machines is just so unbelievably pleasant. I love it. I love it so much. Speeds. Yeah, we need the infused alloys. Okay. It eats power too. Like these are wild power eaters. But the, the upgrades help with that. Okay, so now we need to make two energy tablets, I think. And then we need atomic alloy, which is enriched obsidian. Oh, crap. I need diamond dust and... Oh, God, I forgot about the diamond dust. Oh, and I forgot about the... I forgot about the... Oh, frick. I forgot about the... um The enriched... Oh, crap. Crap. Hold on. Uh, enrichment chamber, refined obsidian dust, which I need to make in the crusher. Right, 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 right. That's what I was forgetting. Crusher, where you at, baby? I need basic control circuits. Oh, freaking osmium. Oh my god. Osmium, why are you doing me dirty? Not you, osmium. My brain. The boop boop make that and then we need to make the i didn't save them why didn't i save them pressure and then what was the other one again the infuser right no not the infuser the um oh, i can make it in the metallurgic infuser i just need obsidian dust and diamonds okay hold on can i make obsidian dust the all the mods way hold on Can I make it the... No. I don't think I can. Okay, so I'm just gonna do this the other way then. I'm just gonna do this the other way in the enrichment chamber. Which I need steel casing for, fine. Basic control circuits, osmium, yes. Okay, so you're making those, thank you. Okay, so we've got the enrichment chamber, and then I make this in the crusher. What was I doing in the enrichment chamber? Wait, what? Right, refined obsidian dust, but I need refined obsidian dust in the crusher, which I need. Oh, if my brain could work. Mm. And then to make that, I need the, wait, refined obsidian, wait. I don't remember it being like this, hold on. Wait, wait, what? I don't remember it being like this. Wait. Hmm, hold on. Yeah. So have they made it so... Oh, there we go. In the metallurgic infuser. But we know. But I still need obsidian dust. Wait. 
Oops. Oh, I have obsidian ingots. Oh, that's forbidden Arc arcanus. Oh, I have refined obsidian ingots right here. I guess I got them from something, didn't I? Okay, well that helps me, but that still confuses me as to how to make them because I don't remember them being like that. Okay, whatever. Okay, where's my crusher? Did I not make the crusher? No, I didn't. Oh my gosh, things are falling over. Hold on. Um, oh, it's literally right here. So the crusher, ba-bam. So maybe I will put... I'll just put these here for now, that's fine. And I'll just put cables. Just so we can... I want Robit! Give me my... my robot! Okay, so now to make these, I need the enriched obsidian. Actually, we'll do four. I love the sound of this one! It's so good! What's the enrichment chamber for again? Nope, 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 I'm clicking all the wrong buttons. Oh, actually, we skipped a step because we already had refined obsidian. Okay. So is it locked behind, um... So is it locked behind another thing? Like a quest? Infused alloy, give me that. And this we can take out, we don't need all of those. We'll take those, good, 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 okay. So now this is reinforced alloy, which is diamond and infused alloy. You, wait, what? Oh, I have to empty this, crap. Um, crap, 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 how do I empty the dump? So we'll do you you so if you guys don't know you can't obviously put things in when there's stuff in the tank here so you have to dump it or you can put it i don't know if you can put it into something else normally i'll set this up in like a little system with chests and stuff like that but for now for the sake of finishing the video with robit this is what we're gonna do Diamonds make everything better. So now it's diamond and enriched obsidian. Wait. What did I do wrong? Reinforced alloy. Refined obsidian dust. Was that not refined obsidian dust? Yes. Was it not enough refined obsidian dust? Probably not. I keep forgetting how much refined obsidian dust this stuff takes. Okay, so now we need a personal chest. <gasps> Robin! Oh, you sweet baby bean! Okay, so now we need to make the charge pad. Polished blackstone pressure plate. Wait, what? What am I missing? It's... What? Energy tablet. There it is. There it is. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get rid of these. Get rid of these. Oh my gosh. Pickaxe, please. Okay. So now she's charging. Oh, are you guys ready? Okay, we gotta we got name him. We gotta name him. Timo. And then we're gonna change his look. Change Robert's appearance. Okay, so we're gonna do... Oh, I love this. We're gonna do Pride. Confirm. <gasps> we got our little rainbow baby! Oh my god, hold on. This... Look at him! I need to, I need to mute that charge pad. Push. Look at him. So you can make him follow you and all that stuff. So toggle follow mode, so he'll follow you around. So they're also a furnace and I think, and uh, so when they run out of power, they'll teleport back to their charge pad. 
they will follow you around i'm not quite sure how it works in terms of dimensions and stuff like that i haven't tested that out oh my god look at him look at him oh you cute sweet little thing you are so cute you are so unbelievably cute timo just like you are in real life okay so you can do rabbit crafting you can do rabbit inventory so he can hold stuff for you like this i'll carry it around for you like a little backpack oh Robert and Robert. <laughs> I should have kept it. I should have named him Robert. I should have kept the Robert. Um, I don't know why he has half a heart. I'm not sure what that's about. Um, but yeah, so he has his inventory. He can do smelting as well. Um, he could do repairs. So yeah, he's 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 a, he's a good little a good little bean. Um. So turning off follow mode, he should go back to his pad. He should go back to his pad. Go back to your... Sir? Can I pick him up? How do I... Hi, I'm Timo! <laughs> Teleport back home. There we go. Look at him. Look at him! Oh, he is the cutest, sweetest little precious thing in the whole wide world. I love him so much. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. I am so excited. We got rabbits in. Oh, it was just a great time. And I really enjoyed Ad Astra. So if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like on it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.